we are back in the kitchen we have our lemons here I got uh, these are 10 lemons I'm not gonna be using all of them I also got uh, my ginger which I'm going to peel and actually it's going to go into our remedy which is the carrot juice that we are going to be making and then I also got carrots in the fridge so let me remove all that and uh, get into the juicing Our recipe calls for 500 grams of uh, carrots, fresh carrots. I am going to be using these four large carrots. I'm going to clean them so well. I have an orange, I have two lemons in here, I have fresh ginger, and then a glass of water. So let's get into it. On these, I'm also going to add a quarter of a pineapple just to get the punch because I love pineapple mixed with carrots and that's the juice we are making for our face okay so let's get into it I'm also going to use a bit of uh, pineapple just to add some tanginess to my juice. So a quarter of a pineapple. For the oranges, I'm going to use one orange and uh, I'm just going to cut it this way. Remove the seeds so that I can also press it in my juicer. So yummy. And then I'm also going to cut these lemons as well. So I'm going to be using my juicer here. If uh, you want to buy a juicer, I highly recommend this juicer. It has served me so well. It's Philip juicer and I'm going to be linking up a video that I did on assembling it, disassembling it, and a little bit more of the cleaning and how it juices. It's really nice and uh, yeah, if you're looking for a home use juicer, this is your gadget. So for these, I'm going to remove the seeds and I'll first do this because I can later use this for my soup so nothing is going to waste. So these ones are going to be used for my soup later. So I'm going to do this so that I can get what is coming out from here, like the fiber and then store it so that I can do the, the citrus. For the citrus, make sure you remove as many seeds as you can. Eh? I always fork mine and at least the fork can be able to because I don't want the seeds. Anyway, the seeds won't pass the seed, but it's good if you just remove the seeds first. Like that. It's very easy when you do it with a fork. You are able to target so many of them. So everything is ready. I have removed the seeds, the most I can do. I have also removed the peel for the oranges, but I'm going to be using the peels for the lemons because they are mwah, 
so let's go right ahead and start juicing so first you need to put your juicer on and uh, of course a lot of juice so I'm going to separate a bit of it here and then you can sort put back my container and uh, continue juicing concentrate carrot juice lemon orange and pineapple it tastes so good but remember our recipe also called for water so the recipe is carrot juice which is from fresh carrots one inch fresh ginger one orange and one cup of water so we are going to measure our water up to here we are going to use 240 ml yeah 240 or can i use 300 ml let me use 300 ml of water so i just fetched my water from the dispenser 300 ml of water and yeah this is our juice i'm just going to shake it and then see how it tastes like our juice is ready and oh i'm super excited can i get a clean glass yes let me get a clean wine glass and we are going to serve our drink here just make sure you shake it because carrots tend to decant and we are not going to be too greedy and this is our juice oh look at how amazing it looks look at how amazing the juice looks just look at it mm. and it tastes delicious so this is your second best friend and it tastes delicious. Mm. Perfect. Don't worry about this. This is pure carrot squeeze. And I'm going to show you the third way on how you can make sure that your skin is looking clear. So we are going to use this number three juice and I share the remedy with you guys. So watch out for that vlog in the next video. See you then.